Hey people, as you can see today we've got the Yocan Serum. Um, I vape, so I was looking for basically a dry herb vaporizer that I could use with my uh, vaping mod. Um, here we go, I'm one of these puppies here, the Wismac uh, RX Rulo. So anyway, I wanted basically a vaping top to put on there. I've tried a couple of others of the cheap variety. Uh, I've got this serum actually, it was quite reasonable in price. <coughs> However, I did actually order some extra coils right here, and obviously I'm going to be toking away on herbs. So what I wanted basically was, I get one of these out here and get it close to the camera for you, but first of all I'll show you what it comes with originally. This here is a dual coil. I don't know if you can see, yeah there we go, we can see that just about. Let's try to focus it up a little bit. There we go. Dual coil. Um, which I prefer this donut one. I'll show you the donut one just here. There we go. Let's have a little bit of focus on that. There. It's actually kind of got a nice little chamber to put it in. Uh, it's all made out of ceramic and porcelain. Obviously the coils are contained from underneath that little donut in there. <coughs> so I think that's more preferable for myself. So we'll pop that back in there. And we'll get this little puppy apart. Let's get some focus. There we go. Right, let's get this uh, this herb vaporizer top and uh, get it dismantled so we can see what's inside. Okay. <coughs> it's very nice. All made out of uh, steel and ceramic. So what we'll do is, uh, it doesn't untwist. We just literally pull that apart like so. There. Very nicely constructed, quite reasonable price as well. <clears throat> now, I'm assuming if this is if you do oils or this little bit just pulls off of here, like so. Now we can see we've got the dual coils in there, but I don't want them, so what we'll do is we'll get them stripped out, just twist like so. Any sort of 510 connection. Oh, there we go, a bit lively. <clears throat> so we'll go ahead and put my dry herb vape on in there. Screws in like so. As I said, like any sort of dry herb vape. There we go. Fun little twist. Lovely. And um, what you can do is you can obviously put your herb in there or even your hash if you want to. And put that little cap over the top. I would say that that's not really necessary to be honest. And that's just squidges on there as such. What I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to get one on the go in a minute and. Uh, and have a little try, see what that's like. Give that a little twist, a twist and a push, and it's all back on. Let's get it loaded up. Okay, we've got it at um, 15 watts. Obviously, you can see on the picture it says anything between 15 and 25. So we'll try it uh, at its lowest 15. Okay, let's go. Okay, so let's get this loaded up here. I'm using my iPad to film, so uh, it's not great, folks. I'll get another GoPro again soon. Um, I'm going to pop this on the top, just like so. Press that boy down. It doesn't matter if it's not square or complete or anything. Let's, uh, let's get my little pokey there. Let's put this top on. Let's give it a nice, firm twist and push. So there we go. It's on lovely. Okay, so what we're going to do now... now I've noticed uh, I've got this Wismac mod here. Uh, it provides more than I thought, which is what we need. I, I have noticed that the 510 connection here is 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 not that great. It feels quite loose. But as we start to just get the oh, I don't want to cross thread it, you see. I don't want to make, break my mod. There we go. We're in there now. It feels okay now, it's not loose, it's just uh, the star, I, I don't know what the score is there. So, as you can see on the box there, it says uh, 15 to 25. Now, I cheated, I had a little go of this earlier, right? Um, and to do it at 14, I did it at 14 and um, it was a little bit too harsh, it, it pretty much burnt everything, okay? So, what we're after... 
is to get that THC hit off. Now, the coil in here, I, I can't do it by temperature, unfortunately. So what we're going to do is start off at 9 watts, all right? So I'm going to have a little pull on that and um, turn it around, and you'll see me and see how much vapor I get from it. 